Welcome to the new send to Amazon shipment creation workflow. Why Amazon? Why? My name's Jason with My Amazon Guy, and I'm going to run you through this new UI uh, for FBA inbound shipments that Amazon's rolling out. It says that it is a streamlined, more flexible shipment creation process. If you're like me and you don't want to use the new or the new process because it's streamlined. You can still go to the old workflow by clicking right here when you get automatically put on this new send to Amazon page. If you click old workflow, they want you to take a little uh, survey here. You don't have to click cancel and try or click a submit survey and go back to previous workflow. And then what you have to do here is they have a little trickery. This yellow button will take you right back to the new UI you have to click go back to the previous workflow and then you will you'll be back in the uh, original FBA inbound shipment UI that you're used to. So how do we use the new send to Amazon UI? Um, it's not that bad actually. We'll go into uh, inventory, uh, manage FBA shipments and on the top left here click send to Amazon. And uh, the search by title, we can put our ASIN in here that we're going to send, search by ASIN. And we want to send this, so we'll send 33 units in. Ready, click ready to pack. Click a pack individual units. And we can start packing now, it says. Packing information, how many boxes will these units fit into? Everything will fit into one box, confirm. Box dimensions, four, and 10, 22 pounds, confirm. Same here, everything will fit in one box, confirm. Four, 10, and two, confirm. And then we'll click confirm and continue. Next, it'll ask us when we want to ship it. Let's say the 26th. And then here, it'll let us select our carrier and tell us our product or, or charge for UPS or FedEx or whatever else we're going to use here. And then you'll just click accept charges and confirm shipping. Next step will be your box labels that you're used to. Uh, with the old UI, print those out, confirm the shipment, go to your shipping queue, make sure it's there, and you're ready to send it off. And that's how you use the new send to Amazon FBA inbound shipment UI.